To do this, you will need the following software. Magic Voxel, Goxel, Blender, any image editing software, and Unity. Start by opening up your project in Magic Voxel. Once you're done with modeling, go to bottom right part of your screen and in export, click on the Vox button. Open up Goxel software and inside go to top left part and click on File and Import Magic Voxel. Find your files but import only one at a time. Then go to File, Export and choose GLTF. Afterwards, open up Blender and just like in Goxel, go to File and Import but this time choose GLTF 2.0 and import your files. They will be split up into different parts. Click on one of them and hit A to select all of them. Then in top right in your hierarchy window, hold control and then click on parent node object two times to deselect it and afterwards one time on any of the mesh objects to choose it as the main object. Then when you have all the parts selected, press control J to join them together. Afterwards, delete the parent node object. Your model is now rotated incorrectly. Fix it by selecting it, then press R to rotate and X to rotate around X axis only and type in minus 90 and it should be exactly the same way as it was imported. Before we export the model, last step is to check your UV maps. To do that, all you have to do is to click UV editing in top panel and take a look at the textures of your models to see if they are different. If you don't need to worry about saving space, then you don't have to do this, but I encourage you to create a custom texture slash palette that will work for multiple models. Anyway, in the UV editing panel, you can combine the UV images of all your models simply by clicking on image and clicking save as and then use your preferred image editing software. Once you have your texture image, head back over to Blender and inside shading window, replace the base color node image of each model with your own texture. Also, change the linear interpolation to closest if you see blurry texture. To fix changes in coloring of your models, simply click on the models, press tab to go into edit mode and in top left of the UV editing, you will have a button with two arrows pointing in the opposite direction. Click on it and box select all the faces in the UV image that are in incorrect place and simply move them around using G until they are at the right place. Last step before exporting the models is to check your model origins, which is the yellow dot that you will see somewhere on your model and can be changed by right clicking and choosing set origin. Then go into export, choose FBX and use this preset. You will have to play around with forward and up transform depending on how your model is rotated. Once it's exported from Blender and then imported into Unity, you will see that one voxel of your model is the same size as one cube. So change the size accordingly in the inspector window while importing. Thanks for watching this video, if you enjoyed it, make sure to subscribe and like. But that's everything from me, so have a nice day and I'll see you in the next one, bye bye.